XM one thirty nine runs a commercial for your show. What uh, what station is XM one thirty nine? Hold it up now. Um, and it says every time the commercial runs, the pad data says Ron and Rez. All right, someone's got to get. We need a spell check on pad data. That I know. I, here's the problem, Rez. We have so many uh, computers now that you can't even keep up. And that that wouldn't be us. That would be XM one thirty nine who is screwing that uh, pad data up. So we'll oh, find out. Rezzy and I understand that. Don't get angry. Fezzy, Fezzy with an F. Well, I'm just going by pad data. I'm going by the official pad data. You can't trust it anymore. Um, the uh, uh, Ron and Rez commercials uh, one thirty nine is uh, stars too. Fez. Ooh, nice little station of stars too. Yeah, doing a lot of star work over there. There's a star. I know that they're. Man. I, I know for, for a fact they're huge fans of uh, you and Rez. I do know that. Fez. Nice. Scotty, you're on the Ron and Rez show. Hey, buddy. Uh, rumor has it that Johnny Depp's working on a screenplay for Edward Nizzer's hand. That would be a... a, a oh, 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 oh. That would be very, very watchable. Well, uh, here's uh, Keith. Keith, you're on Ron and Fez. Hey, buddy. What do you say there, give, dude? Uh, hey, just wanted to give Jupiter a big shout out, you know, for taking the hit, the big brother. Taking the hit for the solar system, man. They, you know they did the right things. They yeah, got to Jupiter. They did exactly the right thing. Got in the, got in the way of that, uh, whatever it was that we don't know. Just that's took the hit for us, man. that's a couple of times Jupiter has done that. Took on the sh- uh, yeah, uh, Shoemaker yeah, comment. Would you? Craig Shoemaker? What did Craig Shoemaker say? This was Shoemaker Levy. Eugene Levy? No, different Levy. Did you say the Shoemaker Comet? Comet. You say some crazy shit. <laughs> you really do. How's everything with you and Dave now? I say about the same. Right there where it was before. I'm trying my best. It's Happy Thursdays. Uh, you're not trying your best. You keep calling me Rez now because of a pad data error. I haven't said that once, Rez. Mm hmm. See, that's what you're doing. He's needling me. Uh, Ace, you're on the run. Yeah, but you don't, you don't, never explode, so what's the problem? Ace, you're on a fez. Hi, is this 866-RON-ZERO-RES? It is. Uh, here, not going to do it, Mark. 866-RON-ZERO-RES. That's 866-RON-ZERO-RES. Now, if George W. Bush or Dick Cheney, something happened to them where they passed away, like tomorrow or something. Are you We're, making threats right now? I am not making I don't a want threat. Any parts of this res. I'm not making a threat at all. Would they be one of those people that are going to be looked at fond uh, more fondly in death? Um, or it does it still take so much time? Um, this may seem obvious, but the people who like them will continue to like them more. Uh, and maybe even go up a notch, and the people who don't uh, won't like them at much, but, you know, you, you tend not to hate people who were just killed. Uh-huh. Yeah, I just, I mean, you know, like, Nixon seemed to be more popular after he died. But never popular. No. But yes, B- Bush is going to do, you know, will have his place in history and have people who like him in history. Okay, I, I just I uh, wondering if he would get that death pass, uh, and I think people that what, what's the death pass? Where it's like like with Michael Jackson, you know, people were being nicer about Michael Jackson, talking more about his genius than any of his personal problems that he had. The personal problems are still out there. Uh-huh. Uh huh. They're on TV every night, and they're in magazines every day. The latest is they found another son, who's twenty five years old. Uh, and apparently Billie Jean was his lover. She wasn't just a girl. They say that Elizabeth Taylor has all these answers. He, she's the one, she's the confidant who knows who the mothers are in these cases. Again, so you prove, you're proving my point. That people are talking about all that stuff. It isn't the work at all. It's very little about the work. Uh, Tony Irma on Ren Res. Yeah, hey, buddy. Hey, um, I know tomorrow's Friday. Should I be expecting a resitorial? Um, you're not getting anything with a res name in it. There's not going to be a resitorial. My name is Fez. How come you stopped doing the fezitorials? I thought people had tired of them. 
So what you replace it with? Nothing. Are they tired of nothing? Troy, Minnesota. Hey, Ronnie. Yeah. Listen, Ronnie, I'm unemployed right now, and uh, I really got to do something here for uh, for a job. And I was wondering if you had any tips on how I can update my uh, fesame. Your fesame is important, particularly you have to keep it brief. And with your fesame, it's going to be the first time that people have uh, introduced you at all. That is when you should use res. Hmm? Matt, Matt, you're on the Ron and Rez show. Hey, Ronnie, I just got to say, I, I really get emotional. I really miss soundboard res. 866-RON-ZERO-FEZ. Uh, Jay, New Jersey. Yeah, hi, I'm calling for Rod Hilliard. Uh, got the wrong number, I'm sorry. 866-RON-ZERO-RES, oh, 866-RON-ZERO-RES. Uh, so what is the story with you and Dave, Rezzy? Where's this going? Well, I think what the problem is, Dave does not have any respect for me. He has none. How is that different from anyone else on the planet? Dave tries to... I think other people do have it for me on the planet. Um, Dave tries to uh, undermine me. Dave tries to make something that isn't such a big deal a bigger deal. He oh, he searches and searches for ways to mock me. Um, here is uh, Alex in New Jersey. Hey, what's up? Yeah. So going back to that religion talk, um, I mean, don't you guys think that Catholicism will come back when uh, Jesus is resurrected? Well, the resurrection, and and as a matter of fact, the um, I was. Uh, in a church called Fesurrection when I was a kid. Uh, but uh, it will really... I don't think he even gets Fesurrection at this time. He'll just show up. Uh, Matt, you're on running Fez. What's up, buddy? Yeah. Hey, Ronnie, I'm going into the uh, city this weekend with my girl. I wonder if you could uh, recommend a good restaurant to go to. I'll tell you where I go for all the restaurants. Uh, it's htg.yelp.com. That's where I find out about all the restaurants in the city. Uh, and now a few other places. Incidentally, Fezzivore yeah. Dogs on this weekend. Really? Yeah, Fezzivore Dogs, Tarantino's debut. That's... Who's your favorite? Mr. Blonde, baby. Rusty, you're on the Run and Rez show. Yeah, uh, my television, I have a problem with the uh, resolution of it. Just get a new TV. Here's our good friend, the Lady Trucker. Hello, Lady Trucker. Good afternoon, gentlemen. I'm trying to remember what Rusty's resolution was. You always make a New Year's resolution. I make resolutions. My name is not Rez. Just so everyone knows, despite what Stars 2 is doing on Sirius XM Radio with my name and the mistyping, my name is not Rez. Do not listen to Sirius Stars 2 for, uh, for that information. Uh, Tim in Seattle, you're on the Ron Rez show. Hey, buddy. Yeah. Listen, I was recently fired from my job, and I, I think I was wronged, and I'm wondering if I can... Um if I can sue for restitution. Get a lawyer. Kevin, in Kevintown, you're on the Ron and Rez show. Hey, how's it going? Good. I've been listening to the show for a long time. I was just kind of hoping that Dave and Rez could come to some kind of resolution. 866-RON-ZERO-REZ, uh, 866-RON-ZERO-FEZ. Um, Rezzy, all we are trying to do mm -hmm. is for everybody to get along. That's you and Dave to stop this baby stuff. Eddie in Cleveland. Yeah, I was wondering when you drop this bit and resume the regular broadcast. I'm ready to resume the regular broadcast any time. We don't resume around here. Hmm? Uh, Jim, you're on the Ron and Rez show. Hey, Ronnie B. Uh, sitting around here listening to you guys are great, but uh, I'm bummed out. I ran out of smoke. I need to figure out the best way to smoke some pheasant. Out of my pipe. Uh, some pheasant, that's when you really know you're jonesing. If you're smoking the... Uh... Here's a rhino. What do you got for me, pal? Yeah, you know, I have been looking for a really good fezzipi for some good bruschetta. You guys got any ideas? Uh, I wouldn't even mind us putting out a Ron Rez fezzipi book. I think, I think there's a market for it. I really do. But the cover would be misspelled. Mm -hmm. Because it would be, if you put out a Ron and Rez fezzipi book... Yeah. Rez would be misspelled. Fesipi would be misspelled. Fesipi? Fesipi. What? Huh? Um, Dave, you're on, on the Ron and Rez show. Yo, buddies, what's happening, guys? Yeah. So what were the, uh, what were the results 
for Rez's uh, bet about having sex. What, what happened to that? Uh, like everything else, it just goes away with no payoff. Mike, you're on the Ron and Rez show. Hey, uh, Ronnie, I've been listening a long time. I'm just wondering, is Rez a rag? 866-RON-ZERO-REZ. 866-RON-ZERO-REZ. Where did Davey Mack run down the hall to? Uh, he had to go cut a uh, voice or something. Wow, doing a funny voice there, huh? Maybe, mm. maybe wonder who bit. that rips. Yeah, I wonder what that, what that work's going to be involved in. Will today be the day when he comes back in here? He's going to come back, and I guess he's going to play a funny song or a funny commercial. Will you finally have the balls to rise up? Yes, I will. But not your same stuff where you're just being a baby, one, one, one word. I mean, I want you scared to piss at him. I okay. want you to make him think that, you, that you've lost it. Will do. Um, I don't think he's going to do it. What do you think, Hicks? It's 50-50. I think it might happen to him today. I don't think so. You know why? Why? Some guys like being a welcome mat. Let other guys come in, wipe their feet on them. Sam, what can we do for you? Uh, Ron, I was wondering if we could just take a break from this and maybe play a little uh, face the wrist of the metal child. All right, now you're not even using the as sound in it. Now you're just changing words that begin with F and R. Stay in the stall, big man. Well, uh, Dave isn't back yet. Save that energy. Jason, you're on the Ron Rez show. Yeah, Ron, is this being Rez, the father of Perez? <laughs> yes. Yes, it does. Uh, here is Sean. Sean, you're on the Ron Rez show. Yeah, I wonder if I could make a request for some uh, Trent Fesner, please. There you go. Phase the rest of the metal, child. Brent, you're on the Ron and Rez show. Hey, buddy. Yeah, I'm, I'm wondering. I've lived downtown most of my life. I'm, I'm thinking of uh, moving into a residential area. Got any, uh, <laughs> got any hints? Look for Rezzy. a residential area. It's not that. It's a three-letter name. F E Z. How can you not get it right on pad data? Um. Let me see. Uh, let me see your. Uh, see this way it's spelled. Show me your uh, driver's license. Well, it's not on my driver's license, Ron. Then it's not real. Uh, Alex. Hey, uh, buddies. Did you say something about a Fez erection earlier? Uh, here is uh, Ryan. Ryan, you're on the Ron and Rez show. Hey, uh, if Rez blows a stint, would Dave give him mouth to mouth for his hesitation? Dave, you're on the Ron and Rez show. Hey, guys, I'd love to hear Fez rip Dave, but I have my reservations that he will. Um, here is Adam. Adam, you're on the Ron and Rez show. Hey, Rez, do you still support restitution for the families of black slaves? That's restitution. I have nothing to do with black slaves. Why is everyone lining up against you? They enjoy it. They okay. enjoy it. They're led by Eastside Dave. Because they can get away with it. you got to take their leader down today. Because I'll tell you this, he doesn't respect you and he doesn't fear you. Mm -hmm. And he's glad that he drank your liquor last night and then went home and had a lovely uh, birthday party. And that ruined your night. I don't think he had a lovely birthday party. I'm sure he wasn't even awake two minutes after he got home. Driver, you're on the run of Rez show. Hey, running here, Rez. What's up? Yeah. Hey, I grew up right outside of a huge Indian preservation. Let me tell you, those people are gay. <laughs> Uh, TJ, you're on the run and uh, Rez show. Uh, I was just calling to talk to the uh, ragged of the opera. 866-RUN-ZERO-RES, 866-RUN-ZERO-RES. You know, typos happen. I think everyone who's called in has probably made them in their lifetime. So all you're saying is you made a typo? I didn't even do it. This is Stars 2 on Sirius XM. They're the ones who did it. How's uh, Davey Matt coming along? He's coming. He's, he's probably trying to find some studio right now, but he's sure be cutting it now. Wait, they're screaming in that room of yours, huh? Yeah. Porn.com. First time ever. Access to the entire Porn.com site for free. Free instant access on Porn.com. This means you're going to get access to the world's largest collection of adult videos, porn stars, photos, and DVDs. They've got everything you're looking for at Porn.com. 
on porn.com, they're also going to give you a free password that's going to give you access to uh, 47 bonus sites. 47 other sites that you're getting free access to, thanks to porn.com. Uh, sites like Camel Toe Hose. Camel Toe Hose is great, Fezzi, because uh, you take a woman and she has a camel toe. So uh, that means that she wants it because her vagina looks exactly like a camel's toe. Hot, huh? Free access. That's all through porn.com with their new free access policy. You also get uh, access to sites like My Milf Boss. My Milf Boss is a great site, Fezzi, uh, because your boss is someone's mother and then you want to fuck her. So, uh, by the way, My Milf Boss is also coming to NBC on Tuesdays this fall. And also BlackfeetBootyStreet.com. Blackfeet Booty Street. Uh, nothing like it. You know, Fezzi, a lot of us white guys, we like um, black girls. Mm -hmm. And the reason is, the problem with white girls is their feet are so white. And what I need is some black street. Wait a minute, what is it? Black Feet back Booty feet. Street. Yeah, it's Back Feet Booty Street. And by the way, I lived there for three years, and it's fantastic. Porn Give me some of that booty street. Put that booty street out. Put your booty street out. Here's how you get that free pass. And you know what else to do on booty street? Pull what? your shorts up so I can see your camel toe. I'll see your back feet. Uh, by the way, Blackfoot was also an Indian tribe. Very interesting. So to get your free pass to go on porn.com. The password is just Booty Street. I'm going to give it to you now. Go to the home page. Find the banner ad in the middle of the page that says limited time special offer. Get instant free access. Click on that and you're going to be sent to the VIP registration page. And they're going to give you the rest of the instructions there. By the way, when you get to the reservation area, ask for Carla. This is at porn.com. You must be 18 years or older to join. Or get your brother to help you. And you will have to provide proof of age by using a credit card or an online check at sign-up. That could be out of your mom's purse. And then you get your free pass to the world's favorite porn site, porn.com. I know what I'm going to be spending all my time on Blackfoot Booty uh, Street. Blackfeetbootystreet.com. Porn.com. <clears throat> it's a once-in-a-lifetime opportunity here for this uh, free access pass. Go to porn.com right now and get your fantastic free membership all from porn.com. A uh, quick break, and we're back. Dave versus Eastside, finally. Run a fest show. It's Run and Race Thursdays. Run, run and Race Thursdays. Thursdays. Run and Race. Run and Race. Run and race. It's Run and Race Thursdays. Run, run and Race Thursdays. Run and Race. 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 Thursdays. Run and Race. Thursdays. Run and Race. Run and Race. Oh, let's hear it one more time. It's Run and Race Thursdays. Run and Race Thursdays. Run and Race. Run and Race. See what he did there, Fez? Yeah, I see exactly what he did there. Bring the Davy Mac in. Uh, so, so far now, we got two different things. One is out your friend's um, Mondays, when Dave made fun of you for accidentally outing your friend Sheepy. And now Ron and Rez Thursdays. And why did you do that, uh, Dave? Well, it was kind of funny. Like, you know, mm -hmm. everyone's calling him Rez and stuff. And I thought, you know, let's make a little jingle out of but it. But you never do anything to make fun of me. No, never. He never yeah. does. I remember you were even. I did uh, what time? I remember you were even yeah. upset about this. Fuck Ron Bennington. Yeah, I was, you uh, upset. Don't fucking press that button. <laughs> you told me that you wanted to pit bull Jimmy Norton. I will. Even though he came out at the end and it was just a, a clever ruse. How do I suppose? What am I supposed to believe? I've been looking to pit bull someone for a while now. You have been. Let me make calls to people for you guys. There's somebody I want you to take down. I can't remember who it was. Somebody in this place. Oh, good. I, I, I mean, can't remember. It was somebody with booking. Good. I, I, I'd love an inter-office pit bowling. Yeah. I need one. 
I haven't, you know, I just need He's it. He's the enforcer, Fezzi. I consider uh-huh. him the Dave Schultz of the, <laughs> to throw it back to the old Broad Street bullies. He's the Dave Schultz of the Ron and Rez show. Someone has to do it. Um, I'm going to explain this to you, Dave. Okay. That you're pit bulling. Yeah. Fine. But against me, it's going to stop. You're oh. not gonna keep. You're not gonna keep pitbulling me. Well, I'm not. I'm not pitbulling you. That's 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 a different. No, that's what a- you're fucking doing is you're looking for any fucking opportunity to come after me, any well. opportunity at all. And this is your fantastic production piece. Well, this I, is what took I thirty-five would... minutes to get, just yeah. so you could get a shot at in at me. It was like nine minutes. Let's take a listen to it. It's Run and Red Thursdays. Run and Red Thursdays. Run and Red. Running running running. Like nine minutes. Half of that time was waiting for Delette to load. It's not going to happen. I don't want it done anymore, Dave. Can I hear the All O and right. A thing so I can see how close he gets to him? Yeah, it's whip- to see if they're even. Uh, is see if they're even close. Whip them out Wednesdays. I know you like to rip it off every fucking chance you get. Yeah, it's not even a fucking original thing that he's taking. Well, well no, apparently it, never is. It is. It is kind of original because I I'm the only one who's done it. I'm just, I, if I, anything, I'm In the ri- history of fucking radio. <laughs> I'm ripping off myself. We don't know how to find anything? It's, uh... Oh, you... Go to the EDL real quick, and the the, the original's there, Pepper. You know what I mean? Just let it go. I don't care. Enough. No, I, I know how you, Go to the EDL. I, I don't want to take a million years to do something. I know, it's coming out right now. But it annoys. It really annoys a little bit. Just go to the EDL and then the, the original's there, okay? That's what he does. He annoys. He tries to annoy. He purposely annoys. And then he gets all giddy like a schoolgirl, <laughs> like he's pulled some shit off. I'm happy. I'm a happy person. I'm always giddy. You're a motherfucker is what you are. Oh. You know what? you, Dave. Yeah. You know what you do? You Anytime I talk to you one-on-one or after the show or something, yeah. you got all this fucking sympathy for me, and you got all this help and all this fucking advice on how I can straighten myself out. But you know what? Then, yeah. you, just, then you don't believe any of it because you're the first one to try to fucking jump on me. You are the first one every day. If I say any fuck, if I forget to put a plural, an S on a plural word, you start look. You, you're doing it now. You're looking over at yeah, Ronnie. He looks at me. You're he looking looks, at Ronnie. He starts to laugh. He Pluralizing does. is like. And you're ho- no, you're you're fucking hoping <laughs> that not. you're going to lead everyone else down the path. I'm not trying. You to get anybody. so fucking excited, and then you're always talking about how you want to help me and shit. I do. It doesn't fly, man. Well, it doesn't happen anymore. All right. Well, Stars was the one who did Ron Rez, and I just thought that because you're being fun. a smart ass right now, and you're hoping it's everyone true. jumps on your side. No, I don't want anyone. And I could care less side. if they did. All right. Yes, yes. You know what? Have I? You know? Do I go through stuff? Yeah. Have you helped me in the past? Yes. But you know what? You're fucking taking advantage of it now. You're taking full advantage how, of it. How do you help you? When I was having more troubles than I am now, and he would jump on a mic. But now, his only reason to do it isn't, you know, so he can get better at mic skills, so he can get better with a Sam and Dave show. <laughs> now, the only fucking thing he wants to do is tear me down. Well, that's not true. I do. I it try, is absolutely true. I, br- I bring true. in bits. I uh, had a, saw, a, hit, a hit song, according to Mr. B. Yeah, but then you did Ron and Rez. Yeah. That's another hit one. That's better than the <laughs> Yeah. That's you went running hit. down the hallway. We all saw you through the window. You're running down the hallway. You're so excited to do it. I always run. I'm a hustler. I'm like Pete Rose, baby. Showboat and Pete. Well, I'm not going to lollygag anywhere. You lollygag in here, I'll tell you what. Never. I get here before you now. Well, Fez, I leave at 7 o'clock in the morning to get here at 9.30. Uh-huh. 9.30? That's yeah. early. I get here at 12. And I, I, I leave, I oftentimes do not see my children because I leave the, here at 6 or 7, get home at 9, the kids go to bed at 8. We ought to do something nice for Dave. Thank you, Ryan. No, we're not doing anything. That. I did something nice for cup. Dave yesterday. Pina Took cup. him out, let him get all liquored up like he does, so <laughs> the point of he's making an asshole of himself on the street, made sure he got into a fucking cab, because, Thank trust you. me, you had no, you had no clue which direction you were even going. You had no clue which way was downtown, well, uptown, east or west. Well, I figure I'll let the cabbie figure that out. That's what they're for. I just say port authority. I you're, you're being a smart aleck now. I'm not trying to be. Yes, you are. 
And you're looking over at Ron, hoping he saves I'm you. At I'm the cowbells, actually. What are you gonna do? Throw one of them at Dave? <laughs> no, I would never do that. Um, Pepper has the uh, whip him out Wednesdays. I don't want to hear it now. It's too late. Oh. Pepper's way too late. Uh, Don, you're on the Run and Face show. Hey, buddy, I got an Ichiban for you. What do you say? Hey, good thing this is a XL channel. Uh, Eric, in Florida, you're always running Fez. Yeah, you know, why is why is Fez always attacking Dave when everybody attacks you know Fez and he doesn't get mad at everybody else? That is true. That is true. Fez. You only get mad at Dave. Dave is the one who leads the way. Dave can't wait for me to say something wrong. He counts on it. He can't everybody wait. Everybody else does it too, though. I mean, it's, it's not true. Just if I Dave, I screw up, else. I screw up plenty, and you know, Pepper. I mean, I don't yeah, know. but have you or have you not text me at night? And just text the, like some faux pas the Fez had. Yeah, I've done that. Why? What's I, the purpose uh, of it? Because how does that? Know. You're so fucking interested in helping me. How does that help? It's funny though. I mean, it'll be eleven o'clock at night, and I'll just get some kind of uh, one night he did, and it just said uh, toying costs. Mm-hmm. <laughs> that had the fuck up. Right. Yeah. Yeah, it was a great one. I was so happy that you yeah, got it. Yeah, that's, that's how, you know, that's how you spend your time because, oh, you got to go home and see, and I don't get any time with my wife and kids. Oh, so how do you take the time? S- fucking trying to throw me under a bus. Well, text messages take like two seconds, you know. Mm-hmm. And just when it pops in my head, I just dial the phone, you know. It's like... Is this mumbly thing supposed to be your new smart-ass character? No, I'm trying to be humble. I don't think it's working. Here's Keith in Atlanta. Hello. Hey, hey, Fez, can you hear me? Yes. Hey, um, man, you got more talent than that guy ever will. Dave, uh, it's like talking to a fourth grader, everything he comes up with. That's true. Uh, I just wanted to back you up on that. Thank, Thank you, you Keith. All right, He's bro. not backing you up, Dave. It was like he said I was talented. As, he said I was talented like a fourth grader. So talented, I key on that. Rick in St. Louis. Hey, buddy. Uh, I got a secret, but I have some preservations about sharing it. See They're still doing that thing, Fez. Yeah. Yeah, and now it'll continue even more because Dave's decided, here's how I'm going to spend some quality production time making a Ron and Rez promo. <laughs> <laughs> it just seemed funny to hear you say it. <laughs> Dave, you can laugh all you want. <laughs> I'm not. I don't give a shit. But you're not doing it to me anymore. Okay, I won't. You really mad, Fez? Yes, I'm pissed. Are you mad or just think you are? No, I am pissed. Is this a shoot or a work? This is a shoot. Everything I'm saying is absolutely true. Okay, I won't do it. I won't say anything. I apologize. I do. I apologize. And I won't say anything anymore. Are you just joking, though? Yeah, he totally is. No, I'm not. I'm be, me right now. No, I, I will not say anything. No, about he's Fez, he's ever. waiting right now for me for someone to misspell my name for me to say something <laughs> wrong. He's waiting for it again so he can start all over again. I won't do it. I'm he's never. He's backing down now, but he's ready to do it again. I won't do it again. That's the last song you hear, an original East Side Dave parody song. But that's, here's the that's thing. That's it. It's done. You don't think you sound like uh, Earl used to sound with Dave now? Maybe I sound like Earl, but you know what? I've had enough of it. So I'm going to express what I'm really feeling here. Okay. Enough is enough, man. What if he um, starts to act like um, he's having sex with your dead grandma? <laughs> you him listen to that. Yeah, he can't wait to do it. And he's doing a fake laugh now. Not <laughs> But that's not me. How am I not laughing at Mr. Bankin's joke? That's it's, not my fault. It's you still not taking me seriously. I keep me. I can't laugh at what Ron says now. That's not fair. That's not fair. All right, I won't laugh at what Ron says, and I'm not going to say anything about Fez. That's it. I'm done. All right, you won't laugh at anything I say. No. Are you ready? No more. Let's play "Make Me Laugh." You ready? Yeah. Doesn't it? How's the old theme song for that go? Like, make me laugh once upon a time. Make me laugh all over uh, you the... You ready? No, okay. You can't laugh, us. Right. XM1. These two nizzers walk into a bar. 
Okay, come on. Oh, that was fast. No. That was no. Because you're just. <laughs> you are just. <laughs> Just give me another shot. It's like he's disrespecting you, Therese. Right? That's what he totally does. It's, it's what he it's hopes to do. It's got to do with you, you act like you're laughing at what Ron said. You're laughing at me. I'm not. I swear to God. Can you give me another shot? I yeah. swear to God. I'll be... Um, I'm going to... Just hold uh, on. Let me fucking spray some lace all on myself. And just right. fucking... Collect. Why would you do that? <laughs> I don't know. I got to change something. Ready? Up. No, you told him not to laugh at me. Are you ready, Dave? Yeah, I'm ready. Fag, fag, homo. <laughs> <laughs> he's just fuzzy. He's laughing in your fucking face. He can't take it. He's on the fucking floor <laughs> laughing at me. He fell on the fucking floor. He's got no respect for you. There's oh, none whatsoever. And can I tell you something, just so you know? I'm um, seeing stars. <laughs> you've lost control. <laughs> He's the happy laughing. Uh huh. Yeah. I'm sorry. That's it. That's no, it's harder. not. It's, it's a fuck you, Dave. I'm not. It's not it. It's you. Ne Let's try one more time. And try not to no. laugh. All right. All right. Ready? Wait. <sighs> Are you ready? Yeah, I'm ready now. Okay, here we go. Toying costs. <laughs> That's got right, you laughing that hard. All right, go ahead. Let's try it again. I can't, no. Come on. No. All right, ready? Yeah. This is make me laugh. You can't laugh. Are right, you ready? Yeah. Hold on. Okay. Homo pants juice. <laughs> I'm fucking killing today, huh? He's not even fucking trying. I'm trying. I swear. You're not even trying. You're just a dick. You're just a dick. Who's got no respect? <laughs> I can't do it. I can't do this, man. <laughs> Just don't laugh. I'm done. I can't. All right. I can. Because every time you laugh, you're like, you're laughing in Fez's I'm not... face. That's exactly what he wants to do. He's using not... it as an excuse to try to mock no. me out. No, I'm really I'm really. And you know what? Maybe, you know what? I swear to God. So here's my thing. Don't yeah. act like you want to help me. Don't act like you like me off the air. I do. All I right? Do. I like you off and on the air. Just keep mocking Ew. me out if you want to. Because you know what? I don't. Uh, I don't want to hear. You, you don't mock him out? What was fag fag homo pants? <laughs> <laughs> I got a fucking I got a fucking Good, I hope it leads to a stroke. Oh come on, man. Uh -huh. I'm not the one saying this shit. But you're laughing in Fez's face. I'm you not, are. I'm That's not. exactly what I'm you're doing. I'm not looking at Fez. I'm not even looking at but him. But you're looking through him. You're getting a big kick out of this. I, I out swear. Of, you're getting the biggest kick of your I'm life not. that you got me pissed off. I'm not. I swear. God, I'm not. I'm you, really, you're just he's thrilled. He's making jokes. What? Are you really mad, Fuzz? Yes, I am very, very Over mad. Rez? Over this guy and what he tries to do to me every single day on my own show. I don't try to. I honestly don't. Things just happen. The Ryan Rez came out of nowhere, and right. I just thought, let's play a little song underneath it. Like the Whip Em Out Wednesdays. Mm -hmm. It's like a nod to Ron and Fez and Opie and Anthony all in one. It's like mm -hmm. a great little fucking little thing. Right, so you're done your laughing? If this is totally. an apology, I'm not accepting it. I uh, do apologize. I do apologize. Yes, I'm done. I am not. I'm, like, dead serious. Mm -hmm. It's not going to happen. Asshole come. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> he left an asshole come. <laughs> He's down on the floor, Rez. He's down on the floor, Rez. Faz, he spit all over. He spit all over the fucking thing. And that's your worst thing. You hate spitting. He spit all over. He did yeah. a spit thing. He might as well spit in my face like he's Taylor Mattingly. Oh, no, come on. Well, I mean, you know, I, I was on Taylor's side. I'm not. I, I would never spit on you, though. And then here's what'll happen: the engineers will send out an email. Who's spitting all over the window? And I'll try to cool it off so that you don't catch any shit. I I did it. It's clean. Yeah, up. where would we be without Fez? 
Here is uh, Tony. Yeah, Tony. Ben. Yes. You're a fucking ass, dude. Fucking, wow. you just sit there all day long. So, and then when finally, when somebody fucking Dave steps up for you, then you fuck, you jump all over him for fucking stepping up for you. Fuck, Ron had to kick you off from fucking uh talking to people during interviews because you just sit there and don't say shit. Fuck you, Tony. Fuck you, Fez. I just wasn't since you guys been on XM and you just went downhill from there and fucking Dave sticks up for you every fucking day. He does and not. He does He's a brother to you, Fez. That's the only reason why you're fucking fighting with them. Uh, a little brother. Like, that's what I used to do with my older brothers is we would play with each other like that. Well, guess what? I'm not your brother and I don't want to play with you. All right. I'm I am hurt by this. I'm not like Oh, you really hurt? Oh, yeah. turn it around. I'm a, I'm a jerk. <laughs> Try to well, turn it around. He hasn't yelled at you. What am I supposed to say? I'm not I I didn't realize that it was that bad. And I thought I could joke. But you know what? Maybe you're right. Maybe I shouldn't. I mean, what am I supposed to, you know, what am I supposed to say? I you know. Mm. I'm totally done. It's not. I respect. I do respect any, Fez. You know, like anytime you laugh is like laughing in his face. Right, yeah, are you ready? Yes. The faggot. <laughs> 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 I'm not doing this anymore, dude. I can't do it, dude. You don't even try to try. I'm not trying. They're funny things he's saying. You're not I'm even trying. I, I swear. You know what? God. I'm realizing I'm serious. I'm really fucking funny. Yes. I didn't even know it until today. No, you are. I have like a. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't get a tape together. I'm done. I could be doing those uh, beer commercials <laughs> that the comics do on TBS. Oh, God. Oh, I got the worst headache now. Johnny and PA. Yeah, I think Grandma just has a lot of resentment for Dave because Dave's brother wouldn't get with him back in the day. Oh, good one. You used the correct word, idiot. <laughs> Here's Alex in Baltimore. Yeah, hey, guys. How you doing? Good. Hey, uh, you know what, Dave? This all started when you had to shove Fez's face in the pizza about a year ago. That is ago. true. And you know what? You are the biggest piece of crap around, man. You're always picking on him. You. you know what, Ron? You you are well-spoken. Great interviews. Love it. I always talk about how great you are. Mm. But when you slip up a word, Dave doesn't say a doesn't thing, say thing about said, you. Said, but then he turns right around on Fez. You know what, man? You pick on Fez too much. Fez, yeah. just get rid of his ass. He's and we all make mis sayings and stuff. It happens in this business. Um, even today, I mistakenly said ass cum. Homo <laughs> <pants>. <laughs> Ask him homo. <laughs> that's fucking disrespectful. It's that's all it is. It's a complete oh, lack of respect. You could care less. It's not linked. You could care less about me. I don't get the connection. And you act like you do. He's so just joking. don't act like you do anymore. If this is the real fucking you, fine. He's making jokes. There's right. no connection. I don't get it. I don't understand how it's related to Fez at all. I didn't say Rez or anything. No. I respect him. I respect Mr. Fez. But why 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 can't you hold one make me laugh for him? Yeah. Just I one. That's all I'm asking. I am try I swear to God. This is the last one. Look at me. We're gonna go make me laugh and you gotta hold it for ten seconds. All right. <clears throat> Are you ready? Let me just look at the clock. Okay. Hold it for hold it for Fez. Ready? Mm hmm. Then this is a. <laughs> um, not even one second. Out of ten. You got maybe a half a second. I can't do it anymore. <laughs> and he's the one who invented it. I haven't been able to do it yet. I'm just... Dave uh, in Staten Island. You're on the Ron Rose show. <laughs> Hey Ron, I I gotta jump on uh on Dave's side here. Like Fed is just being a total bitch, basically. Like, I mean, uh, you know, part of what makes this show funny is you guys making fun of each other, and like Dave gets ripped on every day for being dumb and drunk and Irish, and he never Red. cries about it. And Dave is just funny, and he jumped on the Ron and Rez thing, which was funny, <laughs> and you know. I thought that's what the point of the show was, you know, to be funny and entertain the people. And Fez just just cries about it every day. Like, well, I, I let me just say this: you two guys are best friends. Yeah, and Hard something, 
Something has been going on since... What was it? The vacation? Before the mm. the Christmas vacation? Yeah, Chris, uh, yeah, there was problems Christmas vacation. Really? See, this is the weird thing. I don't I don't even know about it. <clears throat> Honestly, I don't. None of this stuff really matters. I I I'm just then I I guess I'm bad with understanding how people are cuz I I thought Fez and I were fine. But I feel, I feel like we're fine. I mean, I mean, if I've made some mistakes, then I apologize. I thought the song was going to be a fun little thing. By the way, I got an email here. Yeah. It simply says, Dear Rez, you have a vagina. <laughs> Best, Jim. Jim! So even the name Jim's funny to you. It's not you laughing at me. The name Jim is so fucking hysterical. Mike in Ohio. Hey, Dave, quit freaking apologizing. This shit is rucking runny. <laughs> Uh, you're supposed to use the word res, genius. Well, he did the Running's funny. F against the R's. Mm -hmm. um, here is Bill in New Jersey. You know, all this kid Dave does is go out and try to find a bus tall enough to throw Fez under, and, sure. and he gets shit for it. Why is that? Could it be the homo smoke pants? <laughs> That's not. Come on. Some of these things are stupid. So everyone's making you laugh now, Dave. I, I, Ron got the giddiness started, and I'm I'm done. Here's a Radio Shark. Hey, who's in charge of the pad data? Here is uh, on our show. Because they're mocking you there too, Fez. They got it. It's got it spelled R E Z. Uh, is that string? No, no, the string's not in today. Dave typed that up before he came in. Oh, here. yeah. yeah. So there's, a, there's another thing he's doing against you. Mm. I know. Thank you, Radio Shark. No, it's catching on. You know, a lot of times, if somebody starts to go in that direction, <laughs> I was in a band called The Wonders, and everyone kept mm. calling us The O'Neaters. <laughs> and then finally, we said, fuck it. We changed our names to The O'Neaters, and then we didn't have any hits. And then later, another band called The Wonders um, got on uh, the Cavalcade of Stars. <laughs> And that they were part of the Playtone Galaxy, and we weren't. Yeah. But it doesn't matter, because now I'm part of Project Smile, and it looks like I'm going to be getting to, uh, to Harvard. <laughs> I'm in Operation Smile. Uh, that's Camille. Hmm? I think. I think you talk about NYC Prep. Camille wants to You grow up faster in New York City. <laughs> it's like you're an adult faster. I'm 17, and I've never worked for a fashion designer of this magnitude in my life. Okay, PC? So, chill. Mm. Brett, MPA. Hey, I hate talent at Dave as much as the next guy, but I think Fez has some anger management issues. This is just like when he blew a gasket on Earl when he was seriously injured. Yeah, that was quite the injury. What happened there? Uh, Earl acted like he hit his head and was released from the hospital, I think, within 20 minutes. Yeah, but do you guys remember this? When both you guys stopped having an Earl, you started fighting with each other. True. That's a good point. <clears throat> Why don't we just call Earl, Fez? Why don't you just quit pointing your Earl aggression at me? I want to, I want to ask you a sincere question. Mm -hmm. Do you really not like Dave? I don't like Dave. <gasps> that does hurt. I'm not going to lie. I mean, And how do you feel about Fez? I love Fez. Truly. And you, I could put my hand on a Bible. Do you believe him, Fez? No, I don't believe I'll him. I'll put my hand on him. I'll swear on my children. Because he'll be yelling Rez again as soon as he can. But that's love. Do you uh, swear on a Bible that you don't like Dave? I don't like Dave. I swear on the Bible. I'm going to ask you now. Mm. You want me to get rid of Dave? No, I don't want you to get rid of Dave. Why not? Because I worry about his wife and his kids. I'll, I'll, if, I, if you genuinely feel like I was Im impeding on your yourself i would i would leave because that is actually how much i care about the ron fez show the show comes first mr b says what special delivery are you doing on saturday i say i don't know because all my energies go into ron fez but if if and if if that was the case i swear to god on my kids i would leave paul in long island you're on the ron fez show if it was 
Listen, man, I just wanted to, I just wanted to tell you, Dave, you're fucked up, man. You're always picking on him. It's not right. It's not yeah. fair. I mean, says is a good guy. He's nothing but good to you, and you got to be such a dick. I mean, look at him. What? Look at him right in the eye. It's I not am. his fault. He's got asshole coming. His home up <laughs> <laughs> I didn't see that coming. I apologize. I <laughs> you lead the way and then you pile on. Somehow you're in, you're in the front and the back of your own group here. I swear to God, I thought he was. He caught me off guard. I'll say this: <laughs> "Homo pants" is a fucking funny phrase. So you don't like him? I don't like him. You think he's bad for the show? Um, I think there's stuff that he does that can be good for the show. What's bad for the show is when he thinks he can start taking shots at me. All right. I don't think that helps the show. So th this has been building up for a while. Yeah. Do you take it out on his family, though? It seems like you do a lot of anti-family stuff about him. No, I don't think I take it out on his family. Mm. Well, I don't think Fez likes my wife, if I had to swear, swear on the Bible Where again. Where did that come from? Well, you just brought up family. Mm. Uh, I, just... Fez? I like Casey. All right. Well, there you go. It's nice. So you like her, mo and and you don't like me? <laughs> Isn't that weird? Yeah, at this point, yes. <laughs> Isn't that strange? What the heck? It, was it because of the song? Like honestly, I I I I shouldn't have done the song then. It was one more straw. The song is great. No, <laughs> I just. All right, we got a break here. We got our guest. Uh, they just texted me. They said they're uh, in a cab on their way from Thirty Third Street. I'm guessing with security, it'll be fifteen minutes before they get up here. Hmm. Because you got a live read? Uh, the Speed Channel. Fastest channel on cable television. It's Speed. Tonight is Big Block Thursday on Speed. One big block of hardcore pounding excitement guaranteed that's going to keep you stimulated all night. Here's what's included in Big Block Thursday. It starts out with the drag racing phenomenon show, Pink's All Out. That's at 8 o'clock Eastern. Enjoy some uh, great drag racing. Uh. It's a good channel. I, I watch it. Okay, Dave? Me? Yeah. No, I'm not. But I'll make do. Incidentally, I sent you an email, Ron. Uh... Just now? Yeah. <clears throat> um, no, I'm very surprised about all this, honestly. I, I must be thick. I mean, I honestly must be thick-headed, because this caught me off guard and all the, the jokes and whatnot. And uh, I do apologize if I hurt Fez. And I won't make songs. That's it. They are done. July 2, 3. Some asshole, uh, thre you know, thread. I don't know any of them. <laughs> Uh, fucking dick. Can you give me negative Fez stuff? <laughs> I thought it might be pertinent right now. See, you're not even fucking taking me seriously. <laughs> you're not. <laughs> keep laughing and I'm keep not, looking I, to Ron. Uh, because I'm nervous, Fez. I am nervous. I, I apologize. What do you want me to say? I mean, I, I apologize. If If Dave died, would you not care? It would take me a while to care. I, uh, today, if, if he dropped oh. dead today, I don't know. I don't think I would care. Would you go to the funeral? I wouldn't funeral? care. No. No, I wouldn't go to the funeral. I'd be there. Would you? Yeah. Thank you. Could you like make do a sure you're dead. speech? Oh, yeah, I would. Make sure I was dead. Mm. So that's not exactly possible. Here's what I do. Here's, right. I already have my speech. Dan. Okay. Friends and family of David McDonald. Starting nice. Homo pants, homo pants. <laughs> Asshole come homo pants. Uh, we'll take a break here. We're coming back.